there's only one big story this week uh, that we're going to talk about. Um, there's only one story in the news. Do you want to take a guess what it is? Or is, it? is it the terrorist threat? Yes, it is. It's the terrorist threat. Um, I thought you were going to say something stupid then, like David Beckham being deselected or something. So, is it the terrorist threat? Is that, yeah, that's what we're going to... All oh, right. Because, <laughs> uh, as he said that as a joke, I, I assumed it was David Beckham being... It's not David Beckham being deselected. It's, that's not the big story. In there. <laughs> so, um, Sorry. I'd like to offer my uh, opinion on this. Please do. I will. Um, once again, we find ourselves in a state of high alert. Um, apparently there is a big bomb campaign which has been foiled um, and as a result uh, the airlines are at a standstill, we're all in a state of, um, of kind of you know, worry, we, we can't travel anymore in safety and I can't help thinking about George Orwell um, and the idea of this terrorist threat does sound a lot like uh, the concept of perpetual war that he advances in, in his wonderful novel 1984. Sorry, is it? Uh, George Orwell, didn't he write, uh, he wrote 1984, and Animal Farm as well. <sighs> Dan, I hardly think you should be uh, getting your opinions from you know, a children's author. <laughs> he's not a children's author, he's, well, Animal Farm is, you know, it is one for the kiddies, I think, isn't it? <laughs> Pigs talking, that kind of thing. It's a serious parable. It's, I mean, it's yeah. <laughs> yeah. No, okay, well, um, uh, yeah, no, no, you're right. And I think the way to combat the terrorist threat is to try and find the philosopher's stone. No, because it's, it's, that will... George Orwell wrote very serious novels, one of which was Animal Farm. It's a parable about the rise of fascism, I mean, is it? Okay. Have you read it? I oh, know, but I think I've seen it. You've something. seen it, have you? You know, the, the Talking Big film. It's... It was out a few years ago, wasn't it? At least you're not thinking about Babe. Oh, yeah. <laughs> but actually, in many ways, though, it, Dan, when you think about it, it does have its parallels. Babe. Yeah, because it's it's, sure. it's it's an allegory for Babe. You know, is actually a Christ figure, and it's an allegory for um, you know, of a uh, of Christian philosophy. Can we get back to it? And actually, um, for instance, A Bug's Life is about the Holocaust. <laughs> and Ice Age 2 is actually about global warming. Sorry. Yeah, it is. It is about. <sighs> and can we just. What? Can we talk about David Beckham?